everyone. This is Yvette from My World of Metaphysics, and yes, I'm back again with one of my manifestation videos. Today, I'm going to give you a simple ritual that you can use using sea salt and cinnamon that can actually usher in money, abundance, in your home using the feng shui method. Now, listen. This can be done at any time, in the beginning of the month or at any time where you feel like you need money to come in. But I do need you to watch this video all the way to the end because I always give extra tips on what to do to make it even better. Now, if you're new to this channel, this is My World of Metaphysics and this is a metaphysical law of attraction channel that gives nothing but manifesting techniques in all different ways. So in return, I'm only asking for you to like, subscribe, tap the bell, but most of all, just keep watching the videos. Now, if you want to know what I'm about to tell you using sea salt and cinnamon that can actually be done in a minute to usher in abundance, keep watching. I'm back, everyone. Now, what is this simple technique that I want to tell you that you can do to usher in abundance? Now, you guys already know I am the cinnamon queen when it comes down to rituals using cinnamon and also sea salt. So today we're going to combine the two and do something that is very simple. But I do want you to watch this video to understand why you're doing it. Why? Because Please don't go out there doing rituals, doing techniques or spells and not actually know why you're doing it and how it works. So now, what are the properties of this? Again, cinnamon brings in abundance. It could be money. It could be opportunities. And sea salt also is a manifester of abundance because it clears out the negativity. So when we use sea salt, we use sea salt to detox but you can also use it to detox your aura, to detox what's going on around you because it is a natural cleanser. And again, this is the feng shui method. So we're going to combine cinnamon and sea salt at the beginning of the month to usher in that abundance. Now, I already spoke to you about the hand washing technique using cinnamon at the beginning of the month. Now we're going to incorporate sea salt in this to make it work even better. So let's just say it's the beginning of the month and you're gonna wash your hands with the cinnamon on the first day of the month. You can, the night before, wash your hands in sea salt or the day before or a few days before, wash your hands in sea salt. So you are flushing away all the negativity that could be around you involving your money, abundance and opportunities. Now, the day of the first or any day that you decide to do this, you're then going to follow it up by washing your hands with the cinnamon. And I'm going to show you because this could be done within a minute or two, everyone. And again, we don't need a pile of cinnamon. We just need a few little drops and that is it. Now, once you wash your hands in the cinnamon, I do want you to pack your hands dry. Once you wash your hands again with the sea salt, you're going to do the same thing. Pat your hands dry. I don't want you washing your hands in the cinnamon or the sea salt and then drying your hands, wiping everything away. Now, one of the tips that I want to give you is you just don't wash your hands in the cinnamon or the sea salt. You have to set your intent on what it is that you're trying to bring into your life. Okay, so let's just say it's money because most people need money to do whatever it is they want to do. So you can say something like, as I wash my hands with the sea salt, anything that is negative around me concerning my money or my abundance or my opportunities has now been banished. As I wash my hands with the sea salt, I am opening the path for prosperity to come into my life. Then when you wash your hands with the cinnamon, you can do the same thing. As I wash my hands with this cinnamon, money comes to me in expected and unexpected ways. As I wash my hands with this cinnamon, money comes to me in large amounts and for the best of all involved. Whatever it is you want to set, but you're setting the intent. Now, another way you can do this, on the first day of the month, you can actually combine the sea salt and the cinnamon together and wash your hands together using this. The only thing that would be different is when you're doing your setting your intent, I need you to also include that you're cleansing away anything that is negative surrounding your abundance and then follow it up with, I am now bringing in abundance in my life. 
because again, the sea salt is going to remove and the cinnamon is going to bring. I have to stop right now just to say, I see my cat has joined us in this video. So now let's see how this works. As I wash my hands with this sea salt, all barriers blocking me from receiving abundance in all different ways is now being banished. As I wash my hands in this sea salt, I am opening the path for whatever it is coming into my life to come at this moment. I thank you, universe, for blessing me. I thank you, God, for blessing me. I thank you, my higher self, for blessing me. For I know everything that I receive comes from within. As I wash my hands with this cinnamon, money comes to me in expected and unexpected ways. As I wash my hands with this cinnamon, money comes to me in large amounts for the best of all involved. I wanna thank you, God. I wanna thank you, universe, for blessing me with abundance coming into my life. Because as I wash my hands with this cinnamon, I am, at this moment, blessed with abundance in all ways. I see myself with money coming in. I see myself with job opportunities. I see myself winning the lottery. I see myself with money being found all over my house. I see myself with money coming to me in expected, unexpected, in large amounts for the best of all involved. God, I wanna thank you. Universe, I wanna thank you. And so it is. And that's all it is. Now, the only thing I'm asking for you to do, again, is to wash your hands with the cinnamon and the sea salt. You can do it together, or you can do it separate. Washing your hands with the sea salt first the night before, and then following it up with cinnamon the next day. Again, you can do this on the first of the month. You can do it whenever you feel like you need money coming into your life. The best days to do this is basically on a Thursday or a Sunday where you're bringing in abundance. You can also do this on a Saturday because you are also clearing away whatever it is that you no longer want in your life. So there's many ways of doing this, but the whole thing is the first of the month is the time when we usually do these cinnamon sea salt rituals, you guys. So have fun. I just told you what to do and I just told you why. Okay, everyone, this is Yvette from My World of Metaphysics and I just told you how to wash your hands with cinnamon and sea salt to bring in abundance. Now listen, only thing I'm asking for you to do is to like, subscribe, tap the bell, but most of all, just keep watching the videos. If you wanna know anything about My World of Metaphysics, everything is in the description from where you can get sea salt and cinnamon, from where you can buy crystals, candles, sage. Maybe you want a private coaching from me or reading. Everything is in the description. So now listen, if you want to be with like-minded friends, I'm here at My World of Metaphysics live every Sunday. Join us. We have people from all around the world that want to know just like you, and we meet Sunday morning.